Hi, this is Al Jones of the MLive Media Group and the Kalamazoo Gazette. People are always wondering what goes on in business and what is about to happen in business development. And here's a little bit of what we know about going on now based on what readers have asked. Uh, people are wondering what businesses will fill out the acreage adjacent to the new Costco store at the corner of Drake and Stadium Road out in Ashtamo Township. Uh, right now, we know that a field and stream will be on one side and Consumers Credit Union is building a new retail center on the other. Uh, is there any movement on, with the Arcadia Commons West development in downtown? Yes, the task force that is working to fill out what is the largest unused plot of land in downtown Kalamazoo has chosen from one of the two uh, economic, develop, uh, economic development uh, organizations that were up to be its partner in that process, but they haven't named which one. We expect that to come up in the next couple of weeks as to who it is, and then they're going to move along with the process of figuring out who's paying for what, what is actually going to be developed, and setting up a range of meetings so that people can have public input on what goes on there. Three, what, uh, what's going on right, behind, right in front of the new Earthfear store at Westage and Kilgore? In a, in a development that's being called Westage and Kilgore, Southern Michigan Bank and Trust out of Coldwater is going to build its first new uh, uh, development in Portage. Next question, is anything going on at the old Hardings in, at Howard and Westage? Yes, uh, the Calendar Willem and the folks that own and operate the Park Street Market on Kalamazoo's north side are working on a plan for what to do with that property, but they haven't really announced anything yet. And lastly, what about the Exchange Building, the downtown building uh, project that was supposed to change the skyline of the downtown? It was announced back in uh, uh, 2011. Uh, $14 million commercial residential project. Uh, nothing has happened so far, but Phoenix Properties, led by, uh, by uh, Craig Taylor, Taylor, is still saying that they are going to put something together there that makes sense, and before the end of the year, they're expected to report to the city what that will be. Thanks.